<laughs> Everyone asks me this. <laughs> my honest degree. I'm back here. I'm applying to like graduate programs. So, I don't want to go straight into a job. I want to take some time to travel, see the world, uh, explore a bit, just have a good time, be young while I can. Um, so yeah, I want to take a bit of a holiday to start. I don't, I don't my brain doesn't work anymore. Like, varsity's destroyed me. So, <laughs> um, yeah, mentally, not my spirit. The spirit's all good. Um, probably, yeah, going to travel a bit and then I'm looking to relocate to Europe, try living there for a bit, move around, uh, figure out what I want from the rest of my life. Um, yeah, get some, some work, some remote work so that I can work travel. So, yeah, catch me in Europe next year. What country are you heading to first? So, probably Portugal. So, Portugal is the easiest for me. Uh, that's where I'm from, technically. Um, so yeah, I'm probably going to be in Portugal for, to start and then you know, move out from there. Sick bro, I'm so jealous. I'm going to have to follow you. No, just come visit. Everyone's welcome. So next year, as I said, I have to complete my computer engineering degree. Fifth year, I'm doing final year. Just got to do the modules that I haven't done yet and finish my final year project. So I'm going to spend my whole year doing that. And also spend the year, you know, probably getting ready for the working world. Applying to jobs, maybe considering going overseas, planning the future of my life. So yeah, really thinking about the next decade of my life in detail and trying to make the beginnings of plans uh, to, to make those dreams a reality. That's what I'm going to be doing next year in 2022. If I don't get in for that, then I've also applied to something called the Commonwealth Scholarship Programme, um, which is the similar idea, but for study at British universities for the same field as well. Um, but in the meantime, there's because their university years only start in September, I believe, um, there's a few months that I can do my own thing. I'm probably going to be working um, at the company I've been working at for the past uh, few years, or I might even go and try to find a new engineering company and then spend some time there, hopefully go down to Cape Town, spend some time working from Cape Town as well, or even go across maybe to Bali and do some remote work from there, so <laughs> we'll see. Um, so I have my big final project for computer engineering that um, I'm yet to know what it is. It will be some form of um, software or computer hardware project, which I'll see soon. Uh, and then I will have um, two other modules, computer engineering modules. Um, and yeah, so that's that will be my last year of studying and then just making the most of my final year at university, hopefully seeing the friends who are still around and making the most of one more year here while I'm still somewhat free. Planning on pursuing my honours degree here at Tux again. Um, it's going to be different. I can't say I'm looking forward to it too much, um, but I think it will be worth it. And in the end, yeah, because current plan is to have two more years of varsity, one year honours one year masters and then after that I'll have a masters degree and then I can get into industry. Just like try to become a graduate engineer at some company. Um, yeah so I applied to a place, did an interview, uh, got rejected from it. Which yeah, tough pull to swallow, like first time doing it, but you know, learning process. So yeah, I've just been doing my project at the moment so I haven't really been going for it that hectically. And also like my parents have told me like working isn't the greatest. So Maybe take a little bit of time after the degree, like just enjoy life, try like live in the moment a bit. So yeah, I'm gonna take a little while off I think and then start applying to graduate programs and then you know, internships. Yeah, so next year um, I'm reading some first year, uh, first semester modules for third year. Um, and then hopefully if everything goes well now, I will probably be taking ERP second semester. And then maybe apply for a job somewhere, start getting some experience, and then in my final year I'll focus on project and some fourth year modules to finish it off. Um, so yeah, I don't think I might finish next year, but we will see. Just have to stick through it. Oh, so that's, that's what's happening stuff. by myself. Everyone asks me this, <laughs> <laughs> including Mitchell, every two days, well, what feels like it. Um, he can't seem to understand that I don't have a set plan, <laughs> and it's not something that clicks in his brain but in short uh, I don't have a plan and that's my plan so if I can and COVID allows it um, just FYI if you're watching this in 50 years time COVID is this pandemic that took over the world and turned us upside down and hopefully it will be cleared by the time I'm watching this with my grandkids or something <laughs> but yeah so hopefully if COVID allows it I'd love to travel the world experience things just see as much as I can see and hopefully I can find some freelance work to fund that and yeah, do it for as long as I can. I'm back here next year.
like the unfortunate ones of us, not doing postgrad, thank goodness, but yeah. Um, finishing so yeah, full first semester and then second semester if I pass tomorrow is only project, which should be quite nice. Good. And yeah, there's a bunch of us here next year, which we can all afford.